Forgot PDF password? Here's how to unlock it. There are a few things you can try. Start by checking if you have another copy of the PDF. Sometimes, a version without a password might be saved elsewhere. If the document was shared with you, try reaching out to the person who sent it to see if they can provide the password. You can also try recalling passwords you've used before or check your password manager in case the credentials were saved there. If these do not work, then there are three main ways to regain access. First, you can use an online PDF password recovery tool. Second, you can try a brute force method to crack the password. And third, you can run a Python script specially built to unlock secured PDFs. Let's try the first method, using an online PDF password recovery tool. First, let's try to open the PDF file that's password protected. As you can see, it's asking for a password. To recover the password, open Google and search for online PDF password recovery. Press enter and click on the first result or any trusted website you prefer. Once you're on the site, you can either drag and drop your PDF file or click the upload button to select it manually. Choose your password protected PDF and click open. After a few seconds, the tool will attempt to recover the password and display it. Copy the recovered password. Now, go back to the folder. Open the same PDF file. Paste the password in the required field, and click OK. And that's it. But there are some major drawbacks. These tools can be slow and often fail if the PDF has strong encryption, as they rely on brute force or dictionary attacks. Plus, services like Lost My Pass may store your files, risking privacy and data leaks. Most free versions are limited, and full features often require a paid plan. Let's try the second method, using the brute force technique. First, download the pdfcrack.exe tool and place it in the same folder as your locked PDF file. Next, click on the folder's address bar, type cmd, and press enter. This will open command prompt directly in that folder's location. Now, type the command pdfcrack.exe, f, your file name .pdf, CO 12345678 and press enter. The tool will start processing, and depending on how complex the password is, it may take some time. Once the password is found, it will be displayed on the screen. Just copy it. Go back to your PDF. Open the file. Paste the password when prompted. And click OK. And that's it, your PDF is now unlocked. The brute force method is slow, may not always succeed, and can heavily use your system resources. It usually works only for simple user passwords, not for editing restrictions. Also, unlocking PDFs without permission may be illegal and violate copyright or data protection laws. Let's also try the third method, using a Python script to recover the password. First, open your browser and go to https colon slash slash python .org. After opening the Python website, hover over the Downloads tab. Then click on the latest version of Python on the right side. This will start downloading the Python installer. Once the download is complete, run the setup and install Python on your system. After installation, open the command prompt, press Win plus R, type CMD, and hit Enter. In the command prompt, type the command pip install pike pdf, then press enter, and the library will be installed. Now, open the folder where your documents are stored. Create a new folder and name it PDF Cracker. Open this folder and paste your locked PDF file into it. Next, you'll need to use a Python script. We've provided the script in the description. In the script, Make sure to update the file name to match your PDF, including the .pdf extension. For example, if your file is named locked.pdf, enter it exactly. Then, click File at the top left and select Save As. Name the file PDF underscore cracker.py and in the Save As type dropdown, select All Files. Click Save. And now your Python script is ready to use.
Now, click on the address bar of the folder, type cmd, and press enter. This will open the command prompt in the folder's location. Next, type python pdf underscore cracker dot py and hit enter. The process may take some time depending on how complex the password is. Once it's done, the recovered password will appear on the screen. Copy it. Open the folder. And launch the locked PDF file. Paste the password into the prompt and that's it. You should now have access. Brute forcing a PDF password with Python is slow, rarely effective, and not beginner friendly. It can take hours with no guarantee of success, especially for long or complex passwords. If you're authorized to access the file or if you have cracked the legitimate password, SysTools PDF Unlocker is a faster and safer option for unlocking the PDF. In this way, you can save yourself from situations like forgot PDF password. It's fast, reliable, and keeps your data safe since everything runs locally. You can find the download link in the description. Once downloaded, simply install the software on your system. This is the interface of the SysTools PDF password remover software. At the top right, you'll see the add file option. Use this to import a protected PDF. There's also an add folder option, which is helpful when working with multiple files or large datasets. For this demo, let's go with add file to import a single PDF. Now, select your protected PDF file. Then click on the open button. This section displays the list of added PDF files. The first column shows the file names along with their paths. Next to it, the size column indicates the file size, and in the permission column, you'll see disabled, which means the files are restricted with read and write protections. If a PDF is password protected, you'll need to enter the password manually in the password column. In this case, only two PDFs are protected. So let's enter their passwords typing in the passwords now and that's it on the right you'll find two buttons remove which deletes a selected file from the list and remove all which clears the entire list so you can import new files if needed now moving to the destination path settings the save button is used to export the unlocked pdf files while the print button allows you to directly print them in this case let's go with the save button this sets the destination path where the exported files will be saved. You can also change this path anytime by clicking the change button. In the option keep source PDF password in output PDF, enabling this will retain the original password on the exported PDF files. If you want the PDFs to be completely unlocked, just leave it disabled, which is the default setting. Note that the password is only required for files that are protected. Now, Let's begin the process by clicking on the unlock button. Once the process is complete, a pop-up message will appear. Just click OK to continue. As you can see, all permissions in the panel have now changed to enabled, indicating the restrictions have been removed. Just below that, there's a small report. It shows the total file count as 10, success file count as 10, and failed file count is zero, which means all PDF files were successfully unlocked and exported. At the bottom, you'll see the destination path highlighted in blue. Clicking on it will take you directly to the folder where the unlocked files are saved. Let's open PDF file to check. And that's it. That's how you can remove password from PDF using SysTools PDF password remover software.